Hey guys, what's up? This is Sarah Faust coming at you from the beautiful Houston, Texas today where it is a gorgeous day to get to the gym and make some gains for yourself. That's where we're headed right now and I thought I would take this opportunity to tell you a little bit about my friend Grace who as I understand it is applying for your show. I'll give you some reasons you might think about hiring her. Grace has been one of my friends, mentors, trainers, coaches in and out of the gym for a ride at two years now. And uh, I could probably talk all day about her awesomeness, but I'll keep it to the point. Since this is about fitness and being a coach, I thought about the things that come to mind when I think of Grace and the things that I think makes a good coach. Grace stands about five foot nothing and maybe weighs 105 pounds, sopping wet, although she'll probably tell you different. She is a powerhouse, so don't let her looks deceive you. When I think of her, I think of the words overcomer. I think of the words inspiring, relentless, perseverant, gorgeous, and I think of the word champion. You see, in our group of friends, some people might call us survivors. We've all gone through something. Uh, we've all overcome something. And we don't really like that word survivor. This isn't about surviving, it's about thriving. And to me, a great coach pushes you past your own limits, past the limits put on you by your world, maybe even physical limits that you have, and encourages you to just kill mediocrity every single day. So if you're not looking for someone to do that, you probably don't want Grace. Because I don't ever associate mediocrity with her. Three years ago, I weighed about 85 to 90 pounds heavier. I actually brought a picture with me, so just a second. That is me. Just overweight, unhealthy, and miserable. And I think about that girl, and the thing that comes to mind the most is mindset. And anybody who has lost a significant amount of weight, or gained a significant amount of muscle if that was their goal, or overcome any goal physically, I think, can probably attest to the fact that it's really easy to revert back mentally to the mindsets of that person that you used to be. If you don't challenge yourself every day, all day, to stay in a different way of being and a different just habits. Grace is the person I call among one or two other very special people to me that challenges me each and every time to push past that limit. When I think about what makes a great trainer or a great coach or even a great friend, the words inspiring come up and motivating and encouraging. But what really is inspiration other than inspiring someone to be a champion themselves? Losing weight is not hard. It is a mathematical equation. It is quite simple, actually. The habits that you need to create to be a better person, to keep the weight off or the weight on, respectively, if that's your goal, muscle-wise, that's not easy. That is a daily thing. And if you want someone to push you hard in the gym, if you want someone to tell you what's what about nutrition, or if you want someone to just tell you to get off your ass, get into the solution, and do ever, ever let mediocrity get you down, probably would want Grace Roundtree on your team. I feel amazingly blessed to have her in my life. I am blessed to have two or three other coaches in my life that push me every day, people I can call and trust. I would love to see her on TV helping other people kill their goals and become better versions of themselves, although I don't ever have to see her on TV to know that she has that. Grace Roundtree is one of the most consistent people I know. I think consistency is probably one of the biggest things that you could have to get to any goal. Consistently inspiring people, however, is really hard. And I think that 
she does an amazing job of it. If you hire her, I promise that you will not only have a pretty interesting show, as there is never a dull moment in her world, but you will have clients or contestants or whatever you want to call them who walk away changed. And if that is the goal of the show, then you've got the right girl on your hands. Hope you guys have an amazing day wherever you are. And pick my girl Grace, because she's awesome.